King Charles III is set to break decades of tradition by writing the script for the second annual Christmas Day speech of his reign. With his Christmas Day message in the bag, King Charles has, according to my source, written the script himself without recourse to advisers, palace insider Ephraim Hardcastle stated. This follows last year's inaugural address to the nation, when officials were only allowed to make minor alterations to fit with archive footage inserted by the producers. The king has learned that he speaks best when he does, so as off the cuff as possible, a talent he learned relatively late in life, Hardcastle added. The speech is one of only a few the monarch can draft without instructions or suggestions from the elected government of the day. Despite this freedom, King George V, who gave the first Christmas speech in 1932, King George VI and Queen Elizabeth II were all believed to have asked for assistance in their speeches from their applicable spouses and their direct advisers. Charles III is changing this tradition to give himself and perhaps even his successors more initiative to speak their minds each holiday season. I am standing here in this exquisite chapel of St. George at Windsor Castle, so close to where my beloved mother, the late Queen, is laid to rest with my dear father. I am reminded of the deeply touching letters, cards, and messages which so many of you have sent my wife and myself and I cannot thank you enough for the love and sympathy you have shown our whole family," His Majesty observed while speaking directly to the camera during his first message on Christmas Day, 2022. Be it for those around the world facing conflict, famine or natural disaster, or for those at home finding ways to pay their bills and keep their families fed and warm," the King added. Charles III's inaugural message also failed to mention his upcoming coronation the following May, which was something his mother spoke at length about in her first message in December 1952. This speech, along with the yearly Commonwealth Day message each spring, allows the British monarch to address their subjects directly and without political implications to avoid. The more well-known King's speech, given each year at the state opening of Parliament, is entirely written by the current Prime Minister and Cabinet of the day, with no room for the Sovereign's own words. This year's Christmas message by His Majesty the King will appear on TV networks across the United Kingdom and Commonwealth, in addition to radio and streaming as well. GVN reported on Hardcastle's remarks.